hi. Oh, there, there, there. Lina is here. Yes. Hi, I cannot find you. There you go. Hi, Kaoni. A long time no see. Yes, it's been a while. Think about. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the old woman in here tried to find your name. It's so hard. I know so my name. I'm using my kid's name for I mean for the oh, account. Yeah. So um, I mean, oh. makes give you difficulties, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, because I spent lots of time in finding your name. I guess everyone's already um, cannot wait to hear your story. So Aww. the time is yours, Adina. Thank you. Hi, everyone. I hope you enjoy my story. Okay, I'm going to tell you a story about a, li a little yellow bird. Yes, yellow bird, just like my shirt here. A yellow bird named Coco. She live, he live all alone, and Coco wish he had a mother. But who could his mother be? One day, he set off to find her. First, he met Mrs. Giraffe. Mrs. Giraffe, but I don't have wings like yours. Next, Coco met Mrs. Penguin. Oh, Mrs. Penguin, you have wings like me. Are you my mother? I'm sorry, but I don't have big round cheeks like yours. Next, he met Mrs. Walrus. Oh, Mrs. Walrus, you have big round cheeks just like me. You must be my mother, aren't you? Well, look, grumped Mrs. Walrus. I don't have strip feet like yours, so don't bother me. No matter where Coco search, he couldn't find a mother who looked just like him. When Coco saw Mrs. Bear picking apples, he knew she couldn't be his mother. Mrs. Bear didn't look like him at all. Then Coco started to cry. Mrs. Bear came running, running to see what was the matter. As she listened to Coco's story, she asked Coco, Coco, if you had a mother, what would she do? Well, I'm sure she would hold me. Then Mrs. Bear held Coco very high. Like this? Asked Mrs. Bear. Yes, and I'm sure she will kiss me. Then Mrs. Bear gave Coco a big kiss. Mwah! Like this? Yes, and I'm sure she will sing and dance with me to cheer me up. Then Mrs. Bear Sing and dance with Coco. I love you, you love me. If you know the song, you can continue to sing with me. We're a happy family with a great big hug. Hug the person next to you and a kiss from you. Mwah! Would you say you love me too? As they both stopped to rest, Mrs. Bear turned to Coco and asked him, Coco, maybe I could be your mother.
sir. You? But, but you are not yellow. And you don't have wings or big round cheeks or strip fit like me. <gasps> My goodness. That would make me look very funny. Don't, don't you think so, guys? A big yellow bear with uh, wings and big round cheeks and strip feet. It might look a bit like this. Coco thought it was funny too. Well, Coco, my other children are waiting for me at home. Do you want to join us for some apple pie? Apple pie sounded in wonderful to Coco. So off they went. At Mrs. Bear's home, her other children were rushing to greet her. Coco met Meet Ellie the alligator, Piggy the piglet, and Hippy the hippo. I'm their mother too. As the soon the sweet smell of apple pie and the lotter filled Mrs. Bear's home. After a delicious meal, Mrs. Bear gave all her children a big round bear hug and Coco was very happy that his new mother looked the way she did. The end. Thank you everyone. That story was taken from this book A Mother for Coco by Keiko Katsa. Hope you all like it. Thank you. Kadina, what a nice story. Finally, Coco, I'm worried about you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. So you like to, yes, yeah, so you like to read a story to, uh, with, to your kids at home with that book? Yes, actually, this is the book that I am famili familiar with, and since this is my first performance, so I need to, to, to read something that I'm used to. <laughs> so I've been reading yeah, this. Right. Over and over. <laughs> That's right, I agree with it. So you're comfortable with the story? Yes, so pretty much. <laughs> but, you know. Really? We, yeah. <laughs> That's okay. We really enjoyed it. Everyone said, love it. And then, yeah, great story, thank Kadina. Thank Yay. you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a good night, everyone. Bye. Bye. Thank you so much, Kadina.